many of you are watching an interview on our website. Rapper Travis Scott sitting down to speak with radio personality Charlemagne the God. This is the first time he has publicly been questioned about the Astro World tragedy. Ten of his fans died as a result of the crowd surge at that concert. ABC 13 reporter Steve Campion joined us live outside Energy Park. Steve, you and I both have watched this interview now at this point, and when Travis was asked about responsibility, it stands out that he does not give a direct answer. Exactly. He says they're still trying to figure it out. After more than a month of staying quiet, of staying out of the spotlight, Travis Scott did sit down for that one on one interview with a popular radio host. You can see from the faces behind me on the fence here, 10 people did lose their lives at Energy Park last month at Astro World. Scott, the rapper who's from Greater Houston, says he's been on an emotional roller coaster ever since. These are the faces of the young lives lost at Travis Scott's Astro World. They went to have a good time and never made it home. Video from that night showed fans screaming for help. In an interview with Charlemagne the God posted on YouTube, Scott said he didn't hear those cries. He didn't realize a surging crowd was crushing people to death. When asked in that interview whether he's responsible, Scott didn't answer, saying he's committed to finding out how this could have happened. At the end of the day, um, I don't, I just don't, you know, a Travis Scott show or, you know, an Astro World show, you know, wasn't the bottom line factor of what happened here. Scott said he trusted the professionals to handle safety at the concert. He said he considers his fans family. In that interview with Charlemagne the God, Scott says he wants the families of the dead to know he's praying for them. You know, it's real tough. Um, because I want them to really know that my intentions, you know, wasn't, to, you know, wasn't to harm their family at all. Scott was also asked about whether or not he'll perform anytime soon. He described music and concerts as healing and said it'd be cool to practice that again.